left nearly speechless. Toronto Mayor Rob Ford had little to say after a new video surfaced Thursday showing him in the middle of a rambling rage, threatening to, quote, kill and murder an unknown individual. All, all I can say is, again, um, I, 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 again, I've made mistakes. These, uh, all I can do is reassure the people that... Uh, I don't, I, I, I don't know what to say. Telling reporters he was, quote, extremely inebriated in the video and embarrassed by it, Ford tried to calm the latest round of calls for him to step down. Again, again and again, I apologize. I, when, you're, when, you're, when, you're, when, you're, when you're in that, when you're in that state, you, when you're in that state, um, I, hope, I, hope, I hope none of you have ever or will ever be a... In that state. It's been a whirlwind week for the mayor, who on Tuesday admitted to smoking crack in a so called drunken stupor about a year ago. Many council members are calling the new video disturbing. We've been reaching out to the mayor in every way possible to, to urge him to take some time off, to step aside, to take a leave, to get some help. No matter how many people go to him and how many people talk to him, it is not working. I have uh, unfettered access to the mayor's office. Uh, he he listens to me, um, but so far it's been, I'm staying the course. Those calling for him to leave may face an uphill battle. There are no provisions to force a mayor from office unless he's convicted or jailed for a criminal offense. Maggie Mazzetti, The Associated Press.